Right guys, we are back. Uh, I'm not sure if this is going to be the start of the new episode. Or if this is going to be its own episode, depending on how long this part is. Right, it has taken me about 20 minutes. I'm not kidding, trying to, to climb back up this guy through certain bullshit uh, <sighs> mechanics. I wish there was a few bits that I caught on camera. Especially the bit where you uh, fall through the guy's, um, well, through, fall through the Colossus's palm. That's happened a couple of times, which is annoying. It actually, it's happened once. I fell through his fingers once as well. Just, yeah, really annoying. Anyway, I'm now on the bastard's head, just like I said. i just got to wait for him to stop waving me around like a loony bin. Come on, give me an opening. And I thought we had a really long grip bar, but it actually is not that long. At least it doesn't seem to be that long. Because my god, does that grip bar drain out pretty quickly. Right, I don't know how long it takes him to stop being angry after we stabbed him in the head. Quite a long time by the look of things, but that's okay. Come on, there we go. Got him down to half. The last thing I want right now is to fall off him because I don't know if I could take that level of annoyance right now. Right, let's try and get onto his back a little bit. Oh god, right. Yep, bad stuff is happening. Bad stuff is happening. Right, I did find out if we stab him here. Yeah, he does that. So that generally calms him down a little bit, so we can get a bit of a breather on his shoulder. So if we need some more time, we can just stab him in the shoulder, and he goes into that animation, which is quite nice. I discovered this by accident a minute ago. I don't need to tell you how useful that is. Now we're back on his brain. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, that's got to be the most frustrating part of this game so far. Is just getting on this guy's head. It is way harder than I thought it was going to be. That did not actually trigger. Okay, so let's try. Come on. Come on. Hold on for dear life, Wanderer. Hold on. I promise it's going to be over soon for both of us. Uh, we'll be free of this torment. Come on, come on, and again, you can see like, the, I don't, I think like one of the biggest problem is, the camera can't handle this guy, this guy's too big for the camera, and I think we might have got a little bit greedy there, I think we probably shouldn't have gone in for the second stab, maybe, right, okay, run, no, okay, okay, that was, random and, and fine but I need to recharge my grip bar please no oh shit he is not happy he is not happy I'm recharging my grip bar I am not taking any kind of any kind of chances here no sir oh, okay he's not doing the, the thing now that's problematic but it's okay, it's alright, it's alright. Bubba's not mad at you, sir. Bubba is not mad at you. Can we not calm him down at all? I mean, you know, I don't blame the bloke. We're stabbing him in the brain with a sword after spending about seven years trying to scale him. So... You know. Ooh! Almost. 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 Almost made a mistake that I would not have been happy. Right, okay. Uh, there we go. See, we actually seem to magnetise to his head quite nicely. It's the rest of his body that didn't work so well. I've also decided that I'm probably... Oh, God. I don't even know what direction we're moving in anymore. Uh, okay, that's fine. Come on. Let's get a stab in there. This might be the last one. Yes! Fuck you, buddy. Ah, last of the Colossus. Oh, whoa. 
Yeah, what I'm probably going to do is edit out a lot of the failure um, in the last part and just have this as the final video. Because there was a lot of failure. I'm talking 35 minutes worth of failure. Right, now this is what I'm curious about. I've been looking forward to this since we started. Not the end of the game, but just to see what happens. So they arrived just as the last one was dying. I was going to say, we look dead, but, oh, maybe we are. Our hand is very grey. sword. Oh, we do not look good. We do not look well. Not only did you steal the sword and trespass on this cursed land, you used the forbidden spell as well. What forbidden spell? To be reduced to such a sight. Only being used. Possessed by the dead. Well, that's an arrow to the knee. Here we go. 
Uh-oh. Oh, fiddlesticks. So I guess we were being used for evil all this time. I mean, that much is pretty obvious. So I'm guessing the Colossi were keeping this thing at bay. Is that how is that how Colossi are made? Thou severed our body into sixteen Oh, for an eternity in order to seal away our power. We doormen have arisen anew. the body of this warrior. Place the seal over this entire shrine before it's too late. Oh, we're controlling this. What the fuck? Oh, cool. At least I think... I mean, I'm not quite sure what's going on here. Don't appear to have any... Don't appear to have any... Powers. Hang on. Can't even see the enemies. How do we turn around? Oh, okay. Slow and steady. Hey guys, where you going? It's foot stomping time. Uh, do we have any other powers? Oh, there we go. Alright, get up you bastards. I don't know what you did, but I'm evil. Come on, my friends! You guys are rather resilient. Luckily, I am too. So... Oh! We've got... We can breathe fire as well. Dorman's Rage. What's the Dorman's Rage?
Trick rider. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use the breath attack. Okay. That was a trophy. Alright. I'm a fan of that move. Where are the others? There they are. They're getting away. So, do we have another attack? Oh, so we can jump. Alright. Let's go. They're running. Run, you bastards. Well, I guess these evil sons of bitches didn't resurrect our, our friend after all. That was pretty cool, I'm not going to lie. They're definitely resilient. So, that's interesting. The Colossi were actually evil. They were housing this evil thing's spirit, fractured into 16 pieces. The animation on his uniform, uh, well, his robes, is superb. Oh, dude, we done fucked up. I mean, if there's ever been an embodiment of evil, oh, he only did it for his love as well. He's trying. Oh. We can control this, apparently. Thanks for letting me know, game. Um. I guess we're supposed to be fighting this? I'm not entirely sure. Uh. Ah, there we go. Grip. Grip, you fool. Hold. I guess this is going to be a part of its own, guys. Um. Um. I don't think there's any point in us trying to grip it for too long. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Hold, hold, my friend. I think this is a battle that we can't win. Ah. I wonder if holding on to the last is an achievement. I wasn't expecting us to get defeated. Yeah, it wasn't going to stop until it had our soul. Well, why didn't they do that to start with? You know who the real loser was in this? Argo. A 
And that's a long ass bridge to charge across. Wait, what? So, who resurrected her then? The doorman. But that... That's not something they would do. And they're dead. Aren't they? At least we know that the Colossi were actually evil. Hey! We know that sound. Actually happy to see Argo. Oh, he's wounded. And I guess it's glue factory or nothing now. He's a big horse. Well, 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 that's the end, obviously. That's why the credits are rolling, yes. Um, very, very cool game. Very, very cool game. Powerful ending. Um, however, it certainly um, raises more questions and answers in, in some ways. Um, who are the doormen, apart from an evil god, question mark, who was broken into 16 pieces by someone for reasons. Um, we were obviously some grouchy little oik who was trying to save our girlfriend, question mark, for reasons because she had been sacrificed by someone question mark uh, we got possessed used as their puppet exercised then somebody held up the doorman's side of the bargain even though they're dead question mark and brought our missus back to life maybe as she was possibly and Argo, yay! Does she even know what happened? Probably not. Huh. I feel like there could be more to this story. Quite a bit more, actually. Hmm. But I enjoyed it. Um. It's the sort of game that I will probably never play again. Uh, the fact that... Well, the controls are one big thing that will, will turn me off playing it again. 
Um, and I think... I think they went a little bit overboard with the coins. Um, like, they're spread out over the entirety of the map. And there's 76 or 78 of them. Or something like that. I mean, that's mad. Ain't nobody got time for that. Um, unless they gave you something really, really interesting, but they don't. They just give you a sword that does slightly more power. Uh, slightly more powerful, I should say. Um, time attack mode is interesting. I'm fairly confident I could beat quite a lot of the time attack. Maybe not all of it. Poor ungodly soul. No man shall ever trespass on this place alive. Well, so those two are screwed then. There's no way out. I mean, Argo is basically dog food now. And I guess she has no idea what's going on. Wait, what? Oh, he's got horns. He's been reborn. As some kind of evil devil child. I approve. Haha, <laughs> Argo just wants to go home. That's really sad. <laughs> He's going to painfully climb all those stairs with his broken leg to find out that he can't go home. Unless there's another way. But that doesn't make any sense. Now there is an Easter egg on top of the um, the temple uh, to a garden. But you have to have a maxed out stamina bar to get there. Ooh. The problem with that is apparently, like I said before, you have to complete the game about three times. Well, at least we have meat up here. Don't have to live entirely on fruit. Oh, a friend for Argo. There's loads of creatures. Hmm. 
Okay, if he's meant to be evil, I'm not getting that. Apart from the horns, you know. It's a heck of a castle, to be fair. I'm going to have a look at what all the achievements are. Let's go. Shadow of Colossus Trophy List. Hmm. Let's have a look. Okay, so the number of missable trophies. There's only two missable trophies. That's Dorman's Rage and Seeking Salvation. We've got both of those. Minimum number of playthroughs to get the trophies. <clears throat> Five to six. Yeah. Yeah, I won't be playing. I probably will not be playing this game five to six times. One, I kind of had my fear laughed of one. But for what it was worth, I really enjoyed it. Bearer of the Curse. New Game Plus and Mirrored World modes are now available. Ooh, Mirrored World mode. No, thank you. That always gives me a headache. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. I'm not sure how I'm going to cut up the last hour of footage. I don't know because, like I said, there's like 40 minutes of failure fighting that big guy, uh, the last Colossus, and I don't want to... I don't want to... I wouldn't want to sit through all that, um, which was just me getting ridiculously frustrated, um, which I suppose may have its entertainment value, but... Uh, yeah, I was, I was not a happy bunny at the game to the to the end. Uh, whereas what could possibly be the end of episode nineteen and 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 the start of episode twenty, maybe depending on how I cut it. Yeah, I kind of rage quit. So uh, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But apart from you know the controls and Argo. Um, it was a fantastic game. I really enjoyed it. I do stand by the fact, though, I don't think it was a masterpiece. Um, you know, that's just me personally. It was a very good game, and I think it is a must-play. But it's one of those games that if you play through once or you watch a playthrough, you, you've kind of you've seen it all, you've done it all sort of thing, you know? Well, that's not true. I don't think watching a playthrough of a game is ever, ever the same as playing it yourself. But, um, yeah, it's definitely one of those games that I don't think has any replay value for me. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, I'm quite happy now to, to send this back to the rental, the rental shop and uh, get the next one. So, thank you very much, guys. As always, till next time.